Assalamualaikum My name is Muhammad Shafiq bin Muhammad Shah My metric number is 259-437 And today I want to explain about uh, Berjaya Corporation Berhad For mission and mission uh, The Berjaya Corp mission is to generate consistently profitable return for our shareholder from investment in core business activity by, pro by pro providing direction, financial source and management support of each, each operation unit and for vision to be the organization with nature and carry on profitability and sustainable business in line with the, uh, the group diverse uh, business development and value creation, aspiration and interest of all stakeholder. And for product and service, uh, they have eight product and service. First, uh, uh, they have consumer marketing and retail. And second, property. Uh, the sub uh, company is Berjaya Land. And also, they have hotel resort and recreation. The hotel, uh, the example of hotel is Berjaya Hotel at Langkawi and KL. They also have at uh, outside in Malaysia such as uh, UK and Japan. And they also have gaming and lottery management. Uh, then they have financial service. Uh, and then they have food and beverage. For example, Starbucks and Chikar. Uh, uh, Kenny Rogers uh, then they have education and lastly they have environmental service and then we will talk about internal analysis or strength and weakness they have six strength in Berjaya Corporation per, uh, Berjaya Corporation Berhad first uh, the strength is strong business diversity second strong financial reserve and to own strong market share uh, franchise and next uh, motivate, motivate staff and uh, then the strength is contribute to the local economy and provide uh, employment to nation number seven innovation and development of new product and service number eight indirect economic impact Second last is biggest gaming lottery in Malaysia and lastly uh, strong present in leisure and hospitality statement. And then we talk about 10 weakness in Berjaya Corp. First is lack of control and second pro poor brand image for the guys and third slow decision making. Fourth uh, lack of online present and number five is less research and development and then high rental expenses and also less prof less profit and they also have a limited cash flow and second last is high market share and some product and lastly centralized system for IFE Berjaya Corp uh, we we put IFE uh, like example on the, uh, the table show and first uh, for strong business diversity we put weight uh, 0.1 and rating is 4 and the result is 0.4 for financial uh, for strong financial reserve we put uh, 0.9 and rating 4 and the result is 0 0.3 uh, 0.36 for for there was for for own strong market share from franchise we put uh, 0.07 and we uh, rate at 4 and the result is 0 0.28 and then uh, for motivate staff we put with 
0.05, rating 3 and the result is 0.15 and number 5, contribute to local economy with port weight is 0.06 and the rating is 3 and the result is 0.18 number 6, providing employment to Malaysia the weight we put 0.06, the rating is 3 and weight score is 0.18 number 7, innovation and development New product and service, we put weight is 0.08, the rating is 4 and the weight score is 0.32. Number 8, in the economic impact, we put weight 0.07, the rating is 3 and the score is 0.21. Uh, second last is biggest gaming lottery in Malaysia, the weight is 0.03. The rating is 3 and the score is 0.18 And last for strength, the strong present in leisure and hospitality segment The rate we put 0.03 and 0.06 The rate is 3 and the score is 0.18 For weakness, the lack of control we put 0.02 The score is 2 and at 0.02, the rate is 2 and the score is 0.04 For poor, poor, brand, poor brand image, we put 0.03, the rating is 2 and the, rate, the score is 0.06 And number 3, slow decision making, the weight we put 0.02, the rate is and the score is 0.04 Lack of online present We put 0.04 for weight and the, rate, the rating is 2 and the score is 0.08 Number 5, less research and development The weight is 0.03 The rate is 2 and the score is 0.06 High rental expenses the weight is 0.07, the rate is 1 and the score is 0.07 and then less profit, this, the weight we put 0.02, the rate is 2 and the score 0.04 and then number 8, limited cash flow, we put 0.02 for weight and the rating is 2 the score is 0.04 and number 9 high market share for some product the weight we put 0.03 the rate is 2 and the score 0.06 and lastly centralized system the weight we put 0.02 the rate is 2 and the score is 0 0.04 that's all for me. My name is Muhammad Abuzdin. Uh, number 259307. Okay, today I will present about external analysis. Uh, it, we have a ten of ten T in Jaya uh, Jaya Corporation. Number one is co branding opportunity. The opportunity to do co branding is one of Jaya Corporation but high advantage. Sign the company on many will know when. It may use core bending to help small bank givers gain traction. Number two is caption stories. The duplication of winning L also provide the opportunity for the group as there has been rise in the number of foreign stories visiting Malaysia. Number three is government policy. The Malaysia government is declared uh, in budget to, uh, to 2019 in one billion we dedicate uh, to assist the low income family in purchase their first income. So, for, for number four, it high use of social media. The number of people who has access, access to the internet is growing and which they come in case in the use of social media. So, number five is the Jaya Corporation Opportunity. Uh, it's um, Jaya Corporation expanding its property development effect in Pahang which launched a new home project which goes to be permanent development value. Number 6 is 
uh, pursue the Fulgin market. The year has been construction on the Canal Park Department project, which is a part of Hanau Garden City at Vietnam. Uh, number seven, in technology to reduce cost. If the food uh, and beverage business use technology for record keeping, smart boiler and oven in the kitchen and online ordering system, it will be a game changer. Number eight, uh, high pollution around all the world. Uh, the pollution has been growing. So the number nine is inflation and interest rate. The cost per item has de decreased because of industrialization, mass production, and economy of scale. So the, the last is the training the employer. Employee, employee uh, training may appear to be waste of the time and money. However, it saves company a lot of money in the way. The next is ten trade in Biaya Corporation. The first is ring the question. Uh, Biaya Corporation Bahai was also affected by the weakening of the ringgit. Number two is cash flow issue, the increasing loyalty. Uh, the, the Biaya Corporation Bahai will now have to pay higher fee to the franchise of FMB chain or corporation chain. The number three is the race of Omsday. Uh, the goal of the Omsday industry has been uh, boon to Biaya Corporation Bahai. Omsday are uh, uh, becoming instantly common amount to risk. So number four is the tested uncertainty. The the race the racing number of the food is has be, uh, become a going concern of for property development. So number five is single side risk. The single side risk of gaming and lottery business also one of the trade. Uh, sport total operation are uh, export in two. Uh, single set risk at uh, as most of F, uh, facility are in Malaysia. So number six is uh, financial risk. Bayaya is facing in intermittent uh, financial risk. Uh, Bayaya maintain an uh, commercial cap uh, capital structure and a uh, consistent healthy financial prof profile due to its strong cash flow generation. Number seven, uh, number seven is competitive technology and uh, and online buying have made it much easier to break into this market. So the number eight is customer change test. Customer have several possibility to order the same food sign. The market is congested uh, with many rival. So number nine is fewer supplier because the market in uh, is extremely competitive. Raw well, material. Uh, supply option are restricted. The, but, and the last is a uh, COVID nineteen and a uh, recent outbreak of COVID coronavirus has put the world on lockdown. It has a negative impact on hotel, restaurant, and tourism. The next is uh, EFE of Jaya Kujabhai. Uh, EFE is an external uh, factor evaluation, so uh, it's a strategy to use to examine company external environment and to uh, identify a variable opportunity and trade. So uh, the EFE method is uh, you can see the ranking is external method to refer how if if you study company current the strategy respond to the opportunity and trade. Uh, the number range from 4 uh, to 1, where 4 mean uh, superior respond, number 3 uh, above, above average respond, number 2 average uh, respond, and number 1 poor respond. The ranking as well as weight uh, uh, assigned subjectively to each factor. In, in example, we can see the company respond to the opportunity is rather poor because only one opportunity has received of a rating of three. Well, the, the rest have received of the rating of one. The company is better prepared to make the trade, especially the first trade. The next is CPM of the Yaya Corporation. CPM is, is a stand, uh, stand for Community Profile 
informatic and it's a powerful strategy analyst to tool uh, cpm all uh, allow business business owner uh, state order and order in to see uh, parties to see the strength and weakness of major community in industry on a single page uh, my name is Shafiq 261243 and I will continue to the strategy analysis and development okay for the first one is the SWOT metric for the SO strategy we carry out uh, the suggestion for the company to develop uh, their brand on social media for the better known by the community so the social media is very important uh, such as the medium to uh, expand the company known by the user because nowadays the social media is popular among teen and adult uh, so it helps to grow their business so the second one is the provide new platform for gaming sector instead of lottery games uh, the company can develop the trendy gaming uh, which is eSport so the R&D department must develop and evaluate the best online video gaming uh, to their segment uh, among teen and elder. Uh, they also can generate profit through the play to win such as uh, the top up in game. So for the last for SO strategy is improve the produce, produce highly skilled worker and producing product and service. Uh, this company using the unrelated diversification strategy which has a uh, nine types of product and services. So the manager have to hire the worker, uh, prioritize based on the types of diversification. Uh, it helps to increase the productivity. Now I will move on to the WO strategy. Uh, the first one is the improve research and develop attractive and provide unique various food and beverage item. So they have to design their recipe menu uh, to change uh, based on the recipe and the packaging in order to fulfill the customer demand the originality also have to be maintained uh, to get the customer known about the product uh, the second one is improve the use of technology in the overall management process in the company to make a better decision to manage the overall company the one platform must be implemented in order to analyze and uh, find the problem and create the solution. So our suggestion is uh, the implementation of big data analytics. It helps to collect all the information and present uh, through the real-time data. So the last point for the WO strategy is to find more profit and focus to all segments of product and services. Mm, so the, they have to focus to all nine types of product. Uh, and always make the improvement to the better customer service in the all related diversification they implemented by the company. So for the ST strategy is the cooperation with other company to expanding the company growth. Uh, for example, the collaboration with other company is needed in order to share the technologies uh, expertise and as the advertisement to make the company known by uh, the people. So the second one is the improved relationship with supplier and company supply chain management. The company needed to find the new suppliers that can provide the adequate supplier by the company. Uh, Berjaya Corporation Berhad also have to strengthen their relationship with existing supplier through discussion and the strategy implemented in order to maintain the continuous supply uh, for the company. So for the last strategy is the WT strategy. Uh, the first point is needed to be more focusing to need and customer satisfaction. Uh, Berjaya Corporation Berhad uh, need to conduct survey related to their customer tested or requirement from time to time. Uh, it can be used to compete with the other competitor in providing the best customer satisfaction in the market and the lastly is the improve the use of digital marketing to increase the competitive advantage and to overcome the safety issue so the digital market is the use of internet mobile device social media uh, search engine and other channel to reach the customer in order to uh, grow their business uh, based on uh, this platform
So this kind of marketing uh, very useful for Berjaya Corporation Berhad in minimizing cost and attract more customer due to what usage of the social interaction uh, such as the, the social media. The technology advancement also uh, being better from time to time uh, based on the customer advancement or the user uh, in the market. Dr. Salma, my name is Nur Fadilin Binti Sam, 261212. Uh, I will present uh, the strategic position and action evaluation metric, which is SPACE. Okay, the SPACE metric is a management tool used to uh, analyze the company and it is used to determine what type of uh, strategy a company should undertake. The space metric is uh, consists of four quadrants where each quadrant suggests a different type of a nature of a strategy which is uh, aggressive, conservative, defensive and competitive. Okay, uh, based on this table, internal uh, analysis is conceived of financial position and competitive position while external analysis is consists of uh, stability position and industry positions. However, the numerical value ranking from uh, positive 1 is worse to positive 7 is best to each of the variables to make up the financial position and industry positions, while numerical value ranking from negative 1 is best to negative 7 is worse to each of the variables that make up the stability positions and competitive positions. So, uh, in the in fin financial positions, the return on asset is uh, not so good, while the liquidity is uh, quite good. For the competitive positions uh, is a negative 2 which is uh, quite good and negative 5 which is uh, market share uh, is uh, not so good. For the stability positions, the rate of inflation and technology change uh, is negative 2 which is uh, quite good. And the industry positions uh, is uh, 5, which is a uh, growth potential, uh, is, uh, quite, uh, is uh, quite good. And 2, uh, financial stability and profit uh, potential is not so good. So, uh, from this, we can calculate the y-axis and x-axis and the coordinate is negative uh, 0 0.2 for x-axis and positive 0 0.4 for y-axis. So, based on this graph, it shows Berjaya Corporation Berhad is uh, located in the conservative quadrant of the metric. Uh, Berjaya Corporation Berhad is able to achieve external opportunities which stand internal challenge and be aware of external threats. Berjaya Corporation Berhad is a firm that is uh, growing in a stable trend but needs to grow. Their few recommend strategy for conservative, diverse business profile sector companies like uh, Berjaya Corporation Berhad, such as market penetration, market development, market uh, product development and related uh, diversification. As a result, uh, Berjaya Corporation Berhad have decided market penetration and product development as the most suitable and practical strategy. Uh, market penetration refers to improving the use of digital uh, marketing to increase competitive advantage and to overcome safety issue. For product development refers to improving uh, the research and development in providing unique various food and beverage items. Next is the quantitative uh, strategic planning metric QSPM. So this quantitative strategic planning metric is uh, objectively uh, indicate which uh, alternative strategy are best.
Okay, uh, based on this table, there I have a list take from the IFE and EFE, which is Strength, Weakness, Opportunity and Trade of Vijaya Corporation Berhad. And uh, they have two strategy alternatives uh, that we have used, which is improve the use of digital marketing in to increase competitive advantage and to overcome safety issue. Uh, and uh, improve the and second uh, strategy alternative is improve the research and develop attractive in provide unique various food and uh, beverage items. So uh, this uh, will uh, use alternative costs, which is one is not attractive, two is uh, somewhat attractive, three is reasonable attractive, and four is highly uh, attractive. So for the strength, uh, we have choose uh, strong business diversification, owning strong market share franchise, and innovation and development of new product and service which is related to strategy and one and strategy two. For the weakness, uh, we have choose lack of online presence, less research and development, limited cash flow, high market share of some product that related to strategy one and strategy two. For the opportunity, uh, we have choose a uh, high use of uh, social media, technology to reduce costs, higher population that related to strategy 1 and strategy 2. For the trade, uh, we have choose disaster uncertainties, competition and customer changing taste that related to strategy 1 and strategy 2. Uh, this uh, will so uh, as a result uh, the second strategy with a high total attractive score which is 2.21 which is uh, to improve uh, the research and develop alternative uh, in providing unique various food and beverage item be the best strategy for Berjaya Corporation to decide their strategic plans. That's all for me. Thank you. Okay. My part for presentation is strategy evolution and monitoring. I will explain about the nature of Strategy first examining the underlying base of the first strategy. Berjaya Corp examines the fundamental of a company strategy from the external and in and internal by using the external factor assessment metric, SWOT metric, space metric, SPM, QSPM, QSPM metric. This metric. This metric focus on change in the firm management, marketing, um, finance, R&D, production, computer information, system strength and weaknesses. Second, comparing expected result with actual result. Berjaya called evaluate, edu, evaluation both long term and objective are commonly used in this process. The criteria for evaluation, the strategy must be measurable and easily valid. If Jaya fail to evaluate this process, uh, action on long term and objective progress is connected. Okay, the, the nature of strategy. Taking corrective action to ensure that performance conform to plan. For final strategy evaluation, taking corrective action, action to ensure that performance conform to plan. Example of the Berjaya cooperation that we, we need uh, altering and organizing structure, replacing one or more 
Okay, individual or revise a business mission. Taking corrective action. Make berjaya cop keep the objective and goal of goal achieved. If taking corrective action, the exit strategy will, will still be used as a reference and will not be cancelled. Okay, next. Rumel's criteria of evolution strategy. First, consistency. Vijaya Corp used this strategy for its intended purpose and policy remains the same. Consistency can guide Vijaya Corp from conflict and management problems. Second, concerns. Concerns refer to the need for strategies to study a set of trends as well as individual trend in evolved a uh, strategy. Strategy must represent an adaptive response to the external environment and to critical change that occur. Criteria for evolved. Third, feasibility. A uh, feasibility of, of strategy can be adapted in the physical, human, and financial resource of the Berjaya. Financial resources are key in the organization as they influence human beings in the execution of all aspects of employment in Berjaya Corps. Last Roman criteria advan advantage. Using an advantage strategy, Berjaya Corp able to compete with external competitor with ex competitor by maintaining a position in in the market. Berjaya Corp ensure that the assist advantage such as skill resources are improved and renewed well. Okay, this uh, model a strategy evolution framework. First step, review a delaying best and difference. If yes, go through take correction action. If no, uh, second step, measure firm performance and difference. Different, if yes, go through take corrective action. If no, continue prison course. Okay, next, the balance scorecard. Okay, the balance scorecard. These uh, pictures uh, show a model the balance scorecard. We can see uh, vision, vision and strategy. First, financial. The success financial. How should we appear to our shareholder? Second, internal business process. To satisfy our shareholder and customer, what business process must we excel at? Third, learning and grow. To achieve our vision, how will we how will we sustain our ability to change and improve? And last, customer. To achieve our vision, how should we appear to our customer? Uh, this this model show for perspective that illustrate the balance to the actual performer of Bajaya Corps, the balance scorecard ensure that the strategy implement, implemented are based on core service and focus on achieve, achieving the vision and mission, and mission of Bajaya Corps. Setting clear a strategy objective will help organization or Bajaya Corps Determine the right measurement in monitoring 
the achievement of the strategy. Okay, that's all from me. Thank you.